<laughs> Babe, did you really not order that? No, I didn't. Here, take it. Oh my god. So we just got our first shipment of groceries. And I am hysterically laughing because I don't know. I don't know who ordered such a large thing of brie cheese. I definitely did not order this. This is the biggest thing of cheese I've ever seen in my whole life. Babe, do you see all this cheese? I don't even know how you open this cheese board entertainment. I can't even eat brie cheese. You can't eat soft cheeses when you're pregnant. Did you order rosemary? No, maybe we got someone else's <laughs> bag. What? Also. We did not order this. Oh, for f sake. Did you order this? Folks, this is why you don't... No. We also didn't order this. Folks, this is why you don't order your groceries online. Oh, for f sake. Right is this here. all the stuff we got? Sarah Melcher. Oh, Sarah Melcher. Sarah, I'm, so, I'm sorry. so sorry. So what was in Sarah Melcher's bag? The brie cheese. This was probably expensive. <laughs> the brie cheese, the shredded leaf greens, and the rosemary. <laughs> Who the f orders rosemary? Sarah Melcher, I'm so sorry. I ordered this, I ordered this, this. This I ordered, you ordered that. I also got this. Did you order these? Crescent rolls? Oh. <laughs> she was going for a French kind of thing. <laughs> she, oh no, she was probably making a cheese board. <sighs> Jasper's just living his best in here. Okay, did you order that huge thing of cheese? I didn't order any shredded cheese. Okay, so we also got, because I ordered this, but I didn't order this. Okay. Bananas. <gasps> I put them up there. Oh, that's two pounds of bananas? That's apparently two pounds of bananas. No way. Oh, I got. No way. This is not two pounds of bananas. Right here. Put it on this. Don't mind our crinkle. Don't mind all of our crinkle. Oh, 2.2 .2 pounds. It's over here. Raspberries over here. So we got everything. Plus, Plus brie cheese. Wow. Cassettes, more shredded cheese. A big thing of shredded cheese. Well, no. We're really sorry to Sarah Melcher, but there's nothing we can do about it. We're definitely not going all the way to Woodman's in Kenosha to drop those items back off. I was laughing so hard about the brie cheese. I was going to pee my pants. That's why I had to go to the bathroom because I was laughing about the brie cheese. I just can't get over this huge block of brie cheese. If our, anyone knows Sarah Melcher, tell her she can come to our house and pick this up. <laughs> Next nursery update. Oh, it's going to be really echoey in here. Um, I'm going to start painting the floor. First, I got to clean it. So I think I'm just gonna vacuum it down and then use just water to wipe off all the dust and grime. And then probably I'll start painting tomorrow. But yeah, once we paint in here, then we just have to do the final, final touches of the walls because uh, it's kind of hard to see on here. But painter's tape kind of sucked and we missed out on spots like that. So, um, floor, and then actually the trim. But, uh, yeah, I hung this light since you guys last saw also. Uh, Ashlyn's in love with it. It was a pain to install. Old houses have very old brackets, and this bracket like hangs down further than it should, or further than this new one allows it. So I'm gonna have to put like uh, some crown molding around the base edge of it, but other than that, it looks good. We got Philips Hue lights in there. I gotta put that remote up still, and then we have to get cases for that, but I'm excited, it's getting, getting there. Getting there. I think after the floor is painted, everything else will just go by really fast. And I don't think the floor is gonna be bad either. Oof. The only thing in the closet. 
think of this new room? Do you like the white floor? Huh? Do you like it? What are we doing? We're changing out the... We got gold covers. Something for the light switch because we have hue lights. And then we have new white because these are old and cream. The gold will look nice though. I think it's gonna look really nice on the green wall. Yeah. But it'll look nice because they'll play it too. Are you sure it's off? No. <laughs> what do you mean no? Why is there tape all around it? I don't feel confident with you switching that out, actually. You know what? You know where? Uh, Do you see how what in in physics right now? Circuits. I never took physics. You're an idiot. No, I'm not. Oh. You're an idiot. It needs to go right there. Don't move this thing. Okay, but the second... Don't, oh, don't move it. But the second you put... You're already scratching the bottom of this. Baby, you're not going to be able to see that. Yes, you are. If we ever take that top off. Okay, then you get a new one. Just five dollars. to my first peekaboo to find out, are you sniffing? To find out if it's a boy or girl, which we, get out of town. We do not know if it's a boy or girl, but somebody does. So they gave us an envelope that said like boy, it's a boy or we love you baby. What did, what did the people before us say? We love you baby boy. Yeah. Yeah. And this one says, we love you little baby. And then a little tush. <sighs> and then all of these pictures. So we went there on Friday and I was freaking out the whole time per huge. And Cody was just straight chilling like it was no big deal. We have our gender reveal next weekend. And the lady was like telling us to look away and to close our eyes when it was time so that she could type the whatever on the thing. And then at the end she goes, 
Yeah, some people think they're slick and they'll try to count my keystrokes when I'm typing, but I always like add a couple extra or whatever as Cody's like remembering exactly how many keystrokes there were. So the first one was how many keystrokes? Eight or nine. Eight or nine keystrokes. And then the second one, the second time she typed it was five. So uh, since then, we both have determined that we both think it's a what? Girl. We both think it's a girl at this point. Which we thought, or I thought boy this whole time. And then we had our first like real ultrasound, right? For our genetic testing. Mm -hmm. And then we had our genetic testing done where they like determine if the baby has any like physical markers for like Down syndrome or any chromosomal abnormalities. And then we both were like, oh yeah, it's definitely a boy. It looks like a boy, it's a boy. And then everyone now thinks it's a girl. So I keep like referring to the baby as she or here she comes or whatever or her. And now that we've had the sneak or a sneak peek. What did they call the ultrasound? It's just a gender reveal? Oh. Now that we've had the gender reveal ultrasound, now we both think it's a girl. So we will find out one week from today whether baby Saul is a boy or a girl. We also got this from the gender reveal. Just a little bunny with the baby's heartbeat in it. Idiot. All right. Um, we're very close to being done with nursery. Floors are painted. I have to do one more coat around the edges, but I think we're good after that. Light is hung and actually fixed now. You still can't, oh yeah. We added, we added that little white piece so that the gap's not showing. Ashlyn painted the trim around the doors. Bow, no. So depending on how much time I have tonight, I might do another coat around the edges and then I just have to do the baseboard. Are we gonna put the rug up before the party? I figured. Okay. All right, we're gonna go grocery shopping. It's like six o'clock. I just went to look at my watch and it wasn't there. Babe, the light is so pretty. Do you love the light with the crown molding? The trim looks better now that it's dry. When it was like not drying, it looked not. All right, thanks for watching this week. Um, until next week. See ya. Mo, get out of here, it's wet. <laughs>